Okay, so find our standard equation of a circle. So with an influence of diameter, 1, negative 4, and 3, 10. So these are the formulas that we're going to use to solve for the equation of the circle. So standard equation of a circle, then center H and K, and the distance formula to compute the length of the line, then the midpoint formula to find the uh, center of the line. So first, we need to compute the uh, center of the circle using this given. So it's x sub 1, y sub 1, x sub 2, and y sub 2. So using the midpoint formula, so we have x sub 1 plus x sub 2 over 2, then y sub 1 plus y sub 2 over 2. So you just have to substitute these values to this formula. So x sub 1, that's 1, plus x sub 2, plus 3. Then uh, y sub 1, negative 4, plus y sub 2, that's 10. Then you simplify, so 1 plus 3, that's 4 over 2. This one, negative 4 plus 10, that's positive 6, then over 2. Then you reduce, so 4 divided by 2, that's 2, and 6 divided by 2, that's 3. So this is the center of the circle. Because we all know that diameter always pass through the center of the circle. Then to compute the length of the diameter, so using the midpoint, I mean the distance formula, to compute the length of the diameter, so uh, x sub 1 minus x sub 2 to the power 2 plus the quantity of y sub 2 minus y sub 1 uh, to the power 2. Then you substitute these values. So we have x sub 2, that's 3 minus 1 squared, then plus y sub 2, that's 10 minus negative 4, then squared. Then you simplify 3 minus 1, that's 2, then to the power 2. This one plus uh, double negative, that's positive. So 10 plus 4, that's 14 squared. Then you uh, simplify. So 2 squared is 4 and 14 squared is 196. Then you add. So 4 plus 196, that's square root of 200. Then you reduce this radical. So 200, so rewrite 200. With one number, it's a perfect number, so that's 100 times 2. Because square root of 100 is 10. So square root of 200 is equal to 10 square root of 2. So this is the length of the diameter. Since in our problem, we have the radius. And radius is half of the diameter. So diameter divided by 2. So our diameter is 10 square root of 2 then divide by 2 so 10 divide by 2 that's 5 so this is now our radius and again the center is 2 3 so our h is 2 and k is 3 then solve now the equation of the circle using this formula so you just have to substitute these values so we have uh, x minus h h is 2 then y minus k k is 3 then r that's 5 square root of 2 then you need to simplify this one. So you just have to distribute the exponent. So 5 squared and square root of 2 squared. Then 5 squared is 25. Then square root of 2 squared is 2. Because you just have to cancel this one. Then uh, 25 times 2, that's 50. So this is now the equation of the circle.